So when I write a book, I try really hard to write the kind of book that uh, I think I would like to read. And it was the same when I came to design the writing retreat, um, because I was thinking of all the elements that I really enjoy and things that I do when I'm planning my writing day. So one of the things that I like to do is yoga in the morning and I like to, it's really important I think when you're taking time out to have things like really nice lunches and I really love the whole country garden theme. We're really, really lucky to live where we do and I wanted it to be somewhere that people could come to relax and also somewhere that people could come for any stage in their writing journey. So we have people who are already published, who are very far advanced on their journey but need just some time out, some creative well-being, some uh, regenerating the batteries and this is just such a really lovely place for them to do it. Equally it's really nice to welcome people at the start of their journey and uh, and to say to them you know you can come here and there's no pressure to do anything but you do have a guide and you have the chance to share experiences in a small group and at the end of your writing journey at the end of the three days that you have with us then hopefully you will have gained something that you'll be able to take away with you as well as enjoyed all the nice food and and, it, and I think meeting people is a huge part of writing retreats. I've been on, on retreats and, and groups where there's been a huge group which in one way is fantastic and, and I love writing festivals and arts festivals but this is something much more intimate, it's more personal uh, and I really like to stay in touch with everyone that I have mentored in the past and this allows me to do that and I think another thing with the writing retreat allows me to take time out from writing my own books and focus on the guests coming to the retreat whereas sometimes people will send me a book and say oh please can you tell me if it's if it's any good and and please could you comment on the first three chapters and it's something that I really really want to do and it's not my place to tell someone whether they're any good or not of course not but I can offer guidance and say oh when I was doing this when I was submitting to an agent this is what I did and I would like to help them if I'm at the awful editing stage of my own book or I'm just about to have one published and we're doing lots of press releases and lots of marketing it's not something that I can give time to whereas to set aside some actual time for the retreat means that I can work on other people's books and I can completely focus my energy my enthusiasm and absolutely everything on them so it's a very kind of I think it is a really intimate process and it's such a lovely thing to have been part of someone else's writing journey.